everybody, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we're continuing on with our Christmas theme and today we have a special guest. Say hi, special guest. Hi. That's my niece, Isla. She's been in some of our other videos, so you might remember her. Boo, do you remember what uh, day we're doing today? Yeah, the fifth day of Christmas. The fifth day of Christmas, and do you know what the fifth day is? Five golden rings. That's right. So. I thought for today's video, um, with doing our five golden rings, um, we could both do five rings each and we can maybe decorate them with different stuff on them. So how you like your rings, like I like a diamond, maybe an emerald, and we can play around with that. All right, so let's go. Um, so there are a couple of different colors to choose from. Do you know what you're gonna start with? I don't think I'm gonna do a black outline for mine. I just normally like to do the black outline, so. Okay, perfect. Well, I'm gonna go in and do the outline for my actual golden ring. And I'm thinking I might go with the color marigold, um, which I think is a nice color. So I'm gonna use the thicker side for myself because I'm not doing an outline. And I'm just gonna really just draw a circle. And that is not a very good circle that I drew, um, but I will clean it up a little bit because I use the thicker side. Means it was I a little think, bit wobbly. Um, for my wind, I think I might do like some birthday. Oh, that's such a good idea. I only just learnt them today. That's right. Isla went and got her ears pierced today, guys. I'm not sure if you can see the way the camera's positioned, but Isla got her birthstone. What's your birthstone, Boo? Um, I can't remember. Ah, uh, amethyst. Yeah, amethyst. Yeah. Can't remember the so name. So it's a beautiful kind of purpley color. That's a good idea. Maybe I'll do birthstones as well. I can't remember a lot of them, um, but at least I'll try. So I might actually start by doing all of the rings and then I'll just do the decorations afterwards. So I've got one so far. I'll do different sizes. I feel like this ring is just like terrible. No, that's a beautiful ring. I love your diamond on top. And you know, you can do different size ones as well. Like I'm gonna do a little one, I'm gonna do a big one. I'll do like a, another big one over here. Because we've got five, so we've got lots we can do with them. And you know what? Circles are really hard to draw. I find that circles can be really tricky sometimes. So this one's like, to me, I'm going to do like a thicker kind of ring here. So I've got one, two, three, and you've got one and two. One, I'm two, just three. trying to do my um, friend's birthday now. What's your friend's name? Ruby. Ruby. Hi, Ruby, if you're watching. What's Ruby's birthstone? Um, emerald. Emerald. That's such a pretty one. I love emerald. Emerald green. Mm. Nice. And do you know also um, different gemstones have different kind of, they're called cuts, the way they look, like the style. And that's a perfect emerald cut. Really good job. I'm going to start off Do with... Like donuts and my teacher's favourite food is donuts. That's my favourite food is donuts. I love donuts. Donuts. I'm, I'm going to do a diamond for my first big one, but diamonds are classically a white colour, so they're a little bit hard to draw, but sometimes the way the light reflects it looks a little bit blue, so... Yeah, maybe I might go for that blue too when I do it. Oh, nice. So I'm going to go with the thin side, and this is called water blue. My um, brothers are diamond. Oh, yes, Hudson yeah, and Spencer. Um, what are the other ones... Oh, what does the my one look like? Amethyst? Yeah. It's like a purpley colour. Yeah, but like what shape is it? Um, maybe like a, there's no real cut for amethyst specifically, but I usually see them in like circles. So that's my diamond ring. Um, I'll do an emerald now, and I wonder if we've got a green that's called emerald. No. I might do, I don't know. I'm going to go in with this. I'm going to go with like a love heart with like a love heart in the side. Cute, I love that. I'm going to go with grass green for my emerald cup. So. I've got two more to go. Nice. What I'm going to do for this is I'm going to do it all coloured in with green. And then what I'll other ones are there? do the black outline. Um, you could do mine. Mine's topaz, which is like an orange. It doesn't have a specific shape. So again, you could do any specific shape that you want. Sorry, Boo, I'm just going to borrow that for a sec. So you could choose a shape. I love that you chose love hearts. That's really cute. Maybe I'll give you... Um, I'm going to go for... Um, oh, a ruby. Oh, you could do a ruby. 
a ruby. So I'm going to go in with a um, a red for my you ruby. Got sort of like a pattern. We got sort of like pattern. I love that. So I'm going kind of like a circly type color. And actually, what I'm going to do is like two on the side as well, one on each side. Oh, thank you. Um, for my ruby. I'm going to copy yours. Thank you very much. Thank you for copying. That means that you like it. Okay. And what I'm going to do is an amethyst as well. Um, I don't have the color amethyst, but I do have a color called vivid purple, which I think will be nice. Say hi to Hudson. Hudson, do you want to say hi to the camera? To everybody watching? Oh. Hudson may be a little bit shy. I'm going to do a amethyst and I really liked your idea Bruce so I'm going to copy and do a love heart. I'm not going to do the pattern because yours is too nice with the pattern. I don't want to copy too much. Um, what colour did you use for Vivid? I just, oh, I used um, one called Marigold. So it's kind of like golden but it's, yeah, it's called Marigold. And okay, um, then last what will I do for my last gemstone? I've got diamond, I've got emeralds, I've got rubies, I've got amethyst. Hmm. What other gemstones are there? Oh, I know. Sapphire? Sapphire is exactly what I was going to say. So sapphire is a blue colour and I'm going to go in with this one here. It's actually just called blue, um, number 286. And for sapphire, I'm going to go for like an oval cut. Actually, like a teardrop cut. And I'm going to do this one as having little sapphires on the side. Three on each side. You said three. Hey? You said three. Three. Three on each side. <laughs> three. Now I'm getting my black, and with my black, I'm going to do the detailing of the shapes a little bit more. And. The idea with all of the gemstones is you want them to sparkle, so afterwards I'll try to make them look like they're sparkling a little bit. How would you do that? Um, I'm not sure. I'm thinking maybe I might do some like light shining off, you know, some like twinkle looking things. But it's a little bit hard because when you're drawing with just textures, you don't have the option to add in like glitter and stuff. I mean, if you have glitter at home and you want to add some to your pictures, that would be really nice. I do. Oh, nice. So these are all your choices with what you want to do. These are your designs. So whatever you like is what you can choose to add on. I got glitter that you have to, but I don't know if mum will let me. And I might do the outline for the diamond just to make that blue kind of stand out a little bit more against the black. Okay, so oops, for to make it kind of look like it's shining, what I'm going to do is use the colors that I had on here and just do so each of the colors that I've used, I'm going to use again. It's like bright lines shining off. Red. Mine might not really look like it's sparkling, but I know what I'm going to do. Okay, nice. I think I might also do a background after. A background? Mm -hmm. Okay. Maybe we can add the background after the video is finished. Because we don't want you guys to have too long a video today. Alright, so... I finished off my five diamond rings. I think boos look so neat. They're very, very pretty. One, two, three, four, five. And just to recap, we've got emerald, diamond, sapphire, amethyst, and ruby. And is that your, which one is that? Your ruby? Um, my, my. Amethyst. So we can shoot for getting. Okay. So maybe we'll pause here and we'll come back and show you guys the finished product. See you soon. Okay, everybody, here are our finished products for the fifth day of Christmas, five golden rings. This is the one that I did and this is the one that Isla finished off. 
And you can see Isla's done some really beautiful shining kind of design around it. Thank you so much for joining me for today's video, Isla. I hope you had fun spending the time. And I hope you guys all enjoyed the video and are looking out for tomorrow's sixth day of Christmas. We'll see you then. Bye.